Good morning, Alaska. I'm Doreen Lorenz here in beautiful Juneau, home of Gold Belt's Mount Roberts Tramway. I'm here with Jim Duncan. Thanks so much for joining us, Jim. Sure, sure. Thanks for having us. Tell me about this tramway. It's the number one attraction in Juneau. That's correct. Well, it's uh, visited by approximately 225,000 people a year, and it's wholly owned and operated by Gold Belt Incorporated, which is a local native corporation, so we're very proud of that fact. And uh, what's nice about the tram is when you buy your ticket, it's good for unlimited rides all day long. No reservations needed, so you can come and go as you choose. And the ride's pretty spectacular. We're going to join us as we go up the ride. They actually have drumming, so you learn a lot about the native culture as well. That's correct. Yeah, so we have a lot of employees here who actually are part Clinket or Clinket, and they help tell the story of the Clinket people of Southeast Alaska. Now, this tramway has been around for a while. How tall is it? How far do you have to go? Well, we start from sea level and then you travel up to 1,800 feet, um, only about four and a half, five minutes. And when you get up top, we let you off the tram cars, and there's lots of things to do and see up there besides the view. Now, I understand that you, once you can buy a ticket, you can go all day long? That's correct. So the ticket, once you get it, is good for an unlimited ride all day long. No reservation needed, so feel free to come and go whenever you like. A lot of fun. Now, once you get to the top, I understand there's a really great restaurant up there. There is, yeah. The Timberline Restaurant, uh, award-winning. Uh, it serves a lot of uh, different variety of menu items, uh, fresh Alaska seafood, and uh, crab nachos are one of the big favorites, and all kinds of uh, beverages uh, from a local brewery company here in town. There is one of the most amazing gift shops in Alaska. That's correct, yeah. Raven Eagle Gifts and Gallery, we carry a wide variety of items, uh, specifically handmade items that uh, are items that are made uh, right here in Juneau in the state of Alaska, and that's dictated by the Silver Hand logo. Uh, what that means is it's made by an artisan that's uh, uh, on an item that is indigenous of this area. So in other words, like a totem pole, uh, that would be a, a, you know, a native artisan on, like, say, a yellow or red cedar type of wood. And there are lots of natives floating around here. Are you native yourself? I am, yeah. I'm uh, Clinket myself, and uh, I'm uh, Eagle Killer Whale, Duck Lady, so I'm very proud of that fact. Uh, and once again, I work for an Alaska Native Corporation, Gold Belt, which owns and operates the Gold Belt Mowers Tramway. And the eagle proclaimed a Thunderbird name, and ravens waited in line. And warriors now on and gave her a song, hummingbirds put it to rhyme. And robins came near, sang in her ears, some blue jays filled in the racket. Salmon were fun, taught her to run, and halibut gave her a jacket. Welcome to Juno, you guys. Well, Jim, how do you say goodbye in Clinket? Well, there is no word for goodbye in Clinket, so we just say Gunish Chish, which means thank you, and thank you for riding the Gold Belt Mount Tramway. Well, Gunish Chish, and stay tuned for more Good Morning America.